When you first get your TSV60, you have to align your scoring blade with your main blade. You only have to do it once, and I'm here to show you how. So there's two things you need to do before you start zeroing out and adjusting that scoring blade. Number one is making sure your guide rail is locked down to your piece of sheet good. Number two is you want to adjust the cams on this rib of the rail right here to knock out the lateral tolerance. Now also, in addition, you'll see I'm doing everything while the saw is unplugged from the CT. The first thing you have to do is set the depth of the scoring blade. It is a single tooth diamond blade that comes with the TSV60. There's a knob back here that adjusts it up and down in depth. So what I've done is I've taken that blade and I have zeroed out that single tooth perfectly to the top of this melamine board so there's no movement, it's zeroed out. Then what I'm gonna do is I am gonna set it three clicks. This is what we have found is the, a great starting depth and it's usually the last time I set the depth of the scoring blade. And it's just one, two, three. And that is each tenth of a millimeter. So let's make a cut and we'll stop it about halfway so we can examine if the blade is cutting at the right depth, the scoring blade, but also it's adjusted to the same width of the main blade. One of the things I want to also point out is you see this is what your scoring blade is. You don't want to start it in the middle. You want to start forward of the board just like this. Okay, so it looks like the depth is set just perfect. But now I loosen the clamps. I'm gonna move the rail off of it so we can see how the scoring blade is lining up with that main blade. And I'll come in here. Okay, so hopefully we can zoom in here and see this, but you're gonna see that it's not lined up perfectly. And you can see right there. So what we have to do is adjust it this way and that way is called left, and I'll show you that on the saw. So we have to adjust the scoring blade in, which on the arrow behind here is pointing to L, which is to the left, it's pointing toward the rail. If it was on the other side, R to the right, it's going out if it was off that way. Now the dial back here has 20 clicks on it, and you know the depth setting was very fine at 0.1 millimeter. There are 20 clicks on this side to side so you could dial it in precisely. And each one of those clicks is 0 0.025. It is a super fine adjustment. So I'm gonna adjust that this way, a few clicks, and let's check the cut again. So this is our first cut, and this is our second cut, okay? Obviously, we're gonna make a third, but you can see the difference from here to here. And I did four clicks to the left. I'm gonna try a few more, and we'll observe it. And like they say, third time's a charm. Wow, so as you can see, with just a couple moments of time in setting up that scoring blade and lining up with your main blade, your TSV60 will produce that perfect cut for you every single time going forward. Thank you so much for watching.